Yo, what's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy Brent back with another video. And I thought I would make a cool, um, cool video on who is the devil in AEW. So, I have narrowed it down to three possible uh, options that they could go with on this and who I think it is. Um, first off, we have... Uh, I say we go with uh, MJF, as you see in the background here, because he is playing the babyface, the babyface character really well, and he could be just simply fooling us all and revealing that he's the devil. But I don't think he would be attacking everybody like that, though. Like um, how he's in the ring, and then uh, this guy and his goons show up you know so and then they attack everybody that he's close to uh here lately so that's the, my number one option number two would be as you see in the video again adam cole um i believe it would be adam cole because he could be faking the injury you know like how um mjf is fooling all of us with this babyface character he's been on as of late. I believe Adam Cole could be faking his injury and he's never really had surgery because um, he has been hurt for a while. I know injuries can, you know, occur and um, be there for a very long time with that person, but he could be faking it. You never know. And he could finally be playing all of us and he could he was in WWE too and then they really they recently released guys like um Dolph Ziggler Mustafa Ali those type of people and which that brings which brings me to my next point would be it's a toss-up for my third option which would be uh, Dolph Ziggler and Mustafa Ali so those are my three options I believe or actually it's a tie again between uh, Jack Perry because he has been gone for a while as well. He could be finally coming back after that little scuffle of him and CM Punk had. And if you think about it, he's a tiny guy behind the mask. So um, it could be Jack Perry for sure. Um, and it could be Mustafa Ali or it could be Dolph Ziggler. Like they all have like same like type body structure, except for Dolph Ziggler, he would be like the biggest guy, I believe, but not by much though. But it still could be him, or it could be like all three of those guys. It could be, you know, uh, Jack Perry behind the mask. It could be Dolph Ziggler and Ali. You know, it could be a combination, or it could be Adam Cole, or it could just simply be MJF. Um, those are my options though. Um, who do you guys think it is? They've had this um, story going on for quite a while now. Um, MJF claims that his mask was stolen. Um, could he be lying about that too? You know, you can't really, you can't really believe what people say because he was heel, a heel for a very long time, and he's just re just recently started becoming a um, a baby face. So I strongly believe it could just be an MJF and then like pulling a wool underneath us all and he could just be hiring some goons, you know, so people don't think it's him behind the mask. And um, or it could be any, any of the other ones that I mentioned, Adam Cole trying to betray him, which we all suspected that was going to happen though. Um, and then my third was uh, Jungle Boy Jack Perry trying to finally return because he's a pretty small dude, but he would have all that hair sticking out of the mask, though. So I don't think that it would be him, but you never know. He could have, like, a totally different hairstyle now. He could have he chopped the hair off. But his body and Adam Cole's body structure would fit, it, would fit the, uh, the persona the most, I believe, in my opinion, though. Um... Or it could just be, or it could just be Adam, not Adam Cole, but uh, MJF. I, uh, 
I think it's uh, MJF because every time he's in he's in the ring, they cut to the the devil, the guy behind the mask, and um, so what do you think? I think it's uh, it's probably going to be him, MJF. I'm strongly leaning toward him or Adam Cole. You know, they, they're probably just playing both of us. Um, if it's not going to be them, it's going to be Jungle Boy, Jack Perry, or Dolph Ziggler, um, and uh, Mustafa Ali. Those are my top picks. I know I said three, but I gave you two additional ones, but they're tied. So technically, it's um, there's still three options. Um, I don't know who would like go to um, the stakes of the stakes of just randomly attacking people backstage that MJF knows, to be honest. So it could be anybody from WWE recently that they released. As in Dolph Ziggler and Mustafa Ali. I wonder if they're like teaming up. You know what I'm saying? Like to form a new stable after this is all over with. I'm ready for them to just reveal who the character is, to be honest. Um, I didn't have my light on this whole time. Sorry about that. But anyway, I think you can see me better with the light on. Um, but yeah, who do you guys think it is? I'm, I've been pretty intrigued by this story as of late. Um, it kind of came out of nowhere. Like I said, NJF claims that he had his mask stolen. You can't really, I don't know if you can believe that. Um, but yeah, the storyline's been pretty good, in my opinion. Um, I just, I've been trying to decide who I think is, you know, myself, who is going to be the devil himself. And I've kind of had a crosshairs between those, between those, um, those two individuals. Um, but D Dolph Ziggler and uh, Mustafa Ali would still have their no, like no contact, no compete clause for like 90 days or whatever it is that they have after they released. So, like, but it could be, it could still be that they're not really competing. They're just like coming around and beating people up. So that's not really competing. That's just ambushing them, taking the coward's way out. So. Yeah, who do you guys think the, uh, who do you think the uh, devil is or the guy behind the mask? Um, as you've seen in that one clip, uh, when Adam Cole and MJF were talking, the mask was just hanging up in the background, like on the wall, uh, as you've seen. So that's who I'm strongly leaning it towards. I could have been, been like an Easter egg that they didn't want anybody to find out about or something. But I've been thinking it's Adam Cole or MJF this whole time. MJ, uh, I'm sorry. And Adam Cole could have been the one, you know, orchestrating this whole thing, as in getting all those goons together, um, you know, attacking people that MJF knows or that has been trying to just simply team up with him and help him out because he's been pretty banged up too. Like the um, like Bullet Cup Gold, um, the uh, Ass Boys, um, yeah, that they uh, beat him up for uh, Jay White to try to take advantage of that. So it wasn't Jay White because he was the first one that got attacked by these goons. So. That's kind of having me think it's MJF as well, but this mess dude is just attacking anybody that he comes in contact with, basically. So it could could be uh, orchestrated by Samoa Joe too, but that's kind of a like a far far fetched statement to um, get behind because yeah, um, he's been trying to help. MJF for some reason but I thought it'd be a cool video for you guys to see and uh, hear my insight on who 
is this masked dude, aka the devil in AEW, is. But, like I said before, I'm trying to, I'm kind of in a crosshairs here with uh, those, those dudes. I hope they reveal it soon because it's kind of been bugging me. I've been thinking about who, who I think it is for, for quite a while now. And, um, I just think it's a tiny dude, you know, but there's a lot of tiny wrestlers that AEW has with them. Again, there's a lot of big wrestlers, big wrestlers that AEW has, but those are my top picks, top three picks for who I think the devil is. But, um, yeah, sorry if you guys thought I was just rambling that whole time, but I was really just focused on, um, my thoughts there. But anywho, give your thoughts down below on who you guys think the, uh, the devil is. Uh, please like the video and subscribe to the channel if you're new so you can um, just stay informed on awesome new content. And as always, guys, peace until the next video.